The Congress has suspended its former youth wing chief uh, who accused the Indian Youth Congress President Srinivasan Bivi of harassment and discrimination. She's been expelled for six years for anti-party activities. Srinivas Bivi was charged just yesterday with outraging a woman's modesty, criminal intimidation and sexual harassment by making sexually colored remarks and that is what the police had charged him with as of yesterday after the woman had made the complaint. The BJP has hit out at the Grand Old Party taking a swipe at its moral of women empowerment. The ruling party also called the Congress General Secretary Priyanka Gandhi Vadra's slogan Larki hoon lar sakti hoon. I'm a woman I can fight. Calling that hollow. This is Congress's model of women empowerment. Sack the woman who alleged harassment. Instead of providing her a platform to hear her grievances, the manner in which she has been removed from the Congress is uninspiring for women. Is the tweet that was put out uh, by uh, Amit uh, Malviya. Uh, this is how the BGP is reacting uh, to the uh, behavior of uh, the Congress party who have sacked, they have suspended uh, uh, this woman and she uh, will not uh, be allowed uh, for uh, the next uh, six years and this is uh, citing, the Congress party is citing anti-party activities as the reason behind it. My colleague Ratnadeep has the details. You know, Congress High Command, All India Congress Committee has taken this decision. It, it was conveyed uh, through a press release. Uh, she has been now suspended from her primary membership for six years. But this is something which uh, was actually in, uh, in the expected lines because even yesterday we had reported uh, that we had picked up from uh, Congress uh, leaders that we sp uh, spoke to in Assam and there was an indication for the last two days from the uh, you know, Congress uh, uh, leadership as well that uh, they are miffed with the way uh, she went ahead to file uh, the police complaint and which has been now uh, uh, you know, uh, registered as a formal FIR and police has started investigation. Remember now uh, she has been maintaining that she uh, is with the Congress and uh, she has no plans to move to any other party given the fact that there were sp speculations on whether uh, uh, you know uh, she uh, whether uh, she is moving uh, towards any other party including the BJP but uh, she had at that point of time ruled out uh, we are still awaiting a uh, response uh, from her side uh, we are actually reporting from outside her residence in Guwahati and uh, as of now uh, there is uh, no response uh, from her side uh, also uh, you know, Assam Cong uh, Congress is yet to make an official response uh, on this, so we'll have to uh, wait to hear from them. But uh, yesterday, even uh, leader of the opposition, Devrata Sekia, actually uh, in a, uh, uh, commented that uh, he doubts uh, the timing of uh, this, you know, series of tweet by the uh, Congress leader and the subsequent police complaint, given the fact that uh, you know Srinivas BB is a leader from Karnataka and there are elections in Karnataka. So uh, Devrata Saiki at that point of time went ahead to say that he feels that it is it is being guided by the party which is in power in both uh, you know uh, center and state uh, without naming the BJP. Uh, however, Assam Chief Minister has also been commenting on this issue, particularly yesterday he kind of criticized uh, the Congress in the way it handled uh, the uh, you know issue. He felt that you know Congress should have solved this uh, within uh, its own platform, but he also indicated that uh, you know since there is a uh, you know uh, police FIR and since uh, the National Commission for Women has also written uh, to uh, uh, you know the DGP of a sample is uh, asking uh, for a probe. Therefore, uh, in both the cases, uh, you know the Assam Police will have to act. In fact, Assam Police has already acted. Uh, the you know the uh, Congress leaders' uh, statement uh, in connection to the case which has been filed in this police station under various section of the IPC. Her statement uh, has been recorded in front of the magistrate under section 164 of CRPC. So that means this is her official statement, which cannot be changed later. And uh, you know, on on the letter which was sent to a sample list by NCW. Uh, the National Commission for Women. Uh, another separate inquiry has started by Assam CID. Uh, in that case, in that inquiry, also you know uh, that uh, the Congress leader's statement has been recorded, and a report will be sent uh, to the NCW for further proceedings. Uh, also, uh, Srinivas BV, the National President of Youth Congress, has been charged with several uh, sections of the IPC, including uh, outraging modesty of women, of physical assault, wrongful restraint. Uh, threatening as well as of harassment uh, with remarks uh, which are of 
uh, you know, uh, sexual color as well as uh, uh, under section 67 of the Information Technology Act.